Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to the Blackwell Deception. Okay, um, uh, we need to uh, figure out where this uh, Munray's place, I think it was, was it? Yeah, Munray's. There it is. So that's Google, or Oogle, I'm sorry. Munray's. Munray's, New York City, 34 East 11th, 11th Street? <laughs> 11th Street? Voted the city one city's number one nightclub by Time In Magazine. All the best in house trance and electronica. Special guest DJ Tomo. We're totally not gonna ha uh, ask you for any uh, IT help, Tomo. Really not. Well, um, let's see. I feel like there's something we should be doing with this uh, Rachel. No connection that I can see. Uh, I don't think they'd set it up that way. Uh, hmm. Well, I guess we go figure out what the. See if we can uh, figure out this one instead. Uh, Jamie's rather than Tiffany's. A twenty dollar cover for this dump? You got robbed. Yeah, I what? I agree. I said you got robbed. What? I look like a slob? <laughs> no. Well, yes, kind of. Ah, just forget it. <laughs> These are placed all over the club. Unfortunately for us. They look pretty engrossed, whoever they are. Looks like it goes to an upstairs lounge. Looks like some kind of flat screen panel. Let's see if we can talk to them. Make small talk. Hi. Um. Not they're sure if they can ignoring hear you. me. Uh, of course they are. Ah, uh, they're terrible people anyway. Search for a song? Virtual DJ by DJ Tomo! Uh... Epileptic... Fish? Yay? Drunk guy! Make Hi. small talk. So... He's just looking at me funny. I guess he doesn't want to talk to me. Nah, he's a terrible person anyway. What do we have? Just bartender drinks? Guy. Make small Hi. talk. Hello. I can't just chat with some stranger. Not here, anyway. Hmm. Bartender? Hi. Hi, got a sec? Hello? She's serving a bunch of customers on the other side. I can't get her attention. The last time I drank on the job, it didn't end too well. Although, believe me, I'm tempted. <laughs> yeah, I might drown out this music. I can't read the labels, but it looks like decent stuff to me. Dance floor. Excuse me, <laughs> could I ask... Hello? Ow, hey, watch the arm. Um, yeah, that's not gonna work. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Speakers, well... Can we... Stairs? There's a sign that says the VIP area is closed. Hmm. I could try and climb over, but I'd get caught instantly. Yeah, I suppose so. Well, switch to Joey. No point in joining that conversation. They can't hear me. Well, plus you're dead. They're hogging that table. Good thing I don't need to sit. Some sort of glowing panel. Looks like it goes to an upstairs lounge. One thing's for sure, these aren't broken. Unfortunately. Give me just a second, I'm gonna add that to my list of things. <laughs> uh, I was hoping to disrupt it, that would've been fun. I can't talk to him, although... Oops. I can't talk to him, he can't hear me. Although he's so far gone, he probably can't hear anything. If you gotta pick a place to drown your sorrows, I suppose this is as good a place as any. Well, I don't know. Drowning your sorrows and losing your uh, hearing at I the same time? To him. He can't hear me. I guess this is what passes for cool these days. I'm so glad I'm not cool. Not much I can do out there. Nobody can see me. 
I've seen better booze, but I don't think the folks here are too picky. She's keeping a pretty close eye on the place. Uh, apparently not close enough to uh, talk to uh, Rosa. Oh. Oh, yes. Jamie. She's quite uh, limber. Yeah. Guess you could say Jamie? that. Jamie? You're Jamie Graham, aren't you? Do I know you? No. No. Not yet, but uh, I hope to change that. You think so, huh? Yeah! Anyway, I'm Joey. Uh huh. So, uh, come here you often? Come here often? Don't think I've seen you before. Maybe you have, but I know I've never seen you. Uh, hey, you probably just I aren't looking hard enough. I wouldn't a rat pack reject like you. Oh! Anyway. Reject? I'll have you know, this fabric is top of the line. Look at me, I'm impressed. Yeah, you should be. That's, that's... Cutting trends of the 1940s. Are you alone? Are you alone here tonight? That's a crime. Whatever. <laughs> I'm here with friends. What friends? Friends, huh? They'll be here any minute. Yeah. Well, in the meantime, how about we get to know each other? How about not? Um... Yeah, so, uh, Joey, you remember all those, uh, snide remarks about, uh, uh, Rosa's, uh, interactions with people? Yeah. Interesting music, huh? Just interesting? Don't talk to me. <laughs> so, how about a drink? No thanks. Come on, just one drink and a conversation. If you still don't like me, you can dump it on me. Deal? Don't tempt me. Are Under you age? even old enough to be in here? <laughs> sure I am. I've got the best ID money can buy. Uh, that's kind of the opposite of that. So what so, brings you here? What brings you here? It's a place to go, right? There are lots it's of places place to go. That. Yeah. Care to dance? Why not? I love this song. That's, that's dancing? Why are you being like this? You barely know me. Please, I've already got a dog back home. Oh! Hey, now that's a bit uncalled for. His name is Benji. You'd like him. You've got a lot in common. Ask about oh, Jamie. Tell me about yourself. You got a question? Ask it. That's what I'm trying to do. Uh, her studies. So what are you studying? Nothing important. How about you? What did you study back in the Dark Ages? Dark Ages? Uh, well, she studied history, so... History. Really? What kind of history? Um... Uh, she said Middle Eastern. Something about Middle Eastern history always fascinated me. Yeah. You know, I used to be the same way. Used to be. Everyone has their own opinion about what goes on there, but it's so ancient. But you can never truly understand anything unless you know where it came from. I know what you mean. Things move so fast nowadays. I know, right? Nobody else gets it. And you do? I thought I did. Once. Not Maybe anymore. Maybe we can talk more about it sometime? Sure. I'd like that. Damn it, now he's actually getting smooth. So, what's the deal with this place anyway? What do you mean? It's loud. It's got zero class. Why come here? To be free, of course. To be free. really alive, you need free? to let yourself go. That, no. I used to be so scared of places like this. No. But they're so liberating, don't you think? No. I could die tomorrow. Life's too short. Or yesterday. You said yesterday. You could die tomorrow. Do you ever think about that? Jeez, what's with the doom and gloom? Uh, he's kind of dead. up, not me. Yeah. I can't think about that. If and when I go, I want to say I enjoyed my life. And have you? What kind of question is that? Of course I have. Really? Uh, incidentally, um, I, I probably shouldn't have turned on this music. This is one. That's one thing that I do remember from the uh, Let's Play that I watch, is that talking to her before changing the music and she'll just kind of blow you off. Uh, liberation. So you think you're liberated? Yes. What is this, I, Ogre Battle? I feel so free now. I always felt something was missing. I needed to get out of my stuffy room and live. And you did and that done. by coming here? I have fun. I've never had so much fun before. And I'm happy, damn it. So much happier. 
Yeah, yeah, that doesn't look like that. all that happens. You were scared of this place? Places like it. I didn't think it was me. I no, I'd agree. It's not, a not really. A year ago. But now, I can't think of anything else. That sounds bad. Check clues. Uh, Say, do you know a guy named Jeremy? Huh? No. Okay. Highline? Have you ever been up to the Highline? The what line? <laughs> Never mind. Uh, Tiffany Walters. Do you know anyone named Tiffany Walters? Huh? No. I'm gonna ask about Gavin last. Do the initials STP mean anything to you? Huh? No. Do you know any Rachels? Huh? No. <laughs> I do not know any Rachels. She's right here. If I have a question, I can just ask her. Okay. Tell me about Professor Appleton. Um, no. I don't come here to talk about school. Aww. Is this the only place you go? For now. I'll move on eventually, but for now, this is where I want to be. Gavin? Do you know anyone named Gavin? Shh. Shut up and dance. No! Oh. Want to know about Gavin? So, who is Gavin anyway? Can you tell me where I can find him? Shh. Shut up and dance. No. You really can't tell me where Gavin is? Shh. Shut up and dance. He's kind of you moving really back and forth. He's not exactly is. moving with the music. Shut up and dance. All right. That's about it, I think. Uh, Why are you being like this? You barely know me. Please. I've already got a dog back home. Hey, now that's a bit uncalled for. His name is Benji. You like him. You've got a lot in common. Why are you being like hey. His name It's about the same thing. So, tell me about You got a question? Ah, for spare time. So, what do you do when you're not lighting up the dance floor? Nothing much. How about you? With your ectoplasmic glow? Um... Help lost spirits move on to the next world? Yeah, books? This usually isn't my scene. You'd find me at home with a book most nights. Really? I used to read all the time. Not anymore? But not anymore? Nah. So what do you like to read? Ah. Oh. Blackwell? There's this book by a lady named Blackwell. Ever hear of her? No. Is she any good? Depends who you ask. <laughs> I'll pass then. Aww. So. You got a cup? So. Nothing much. I talk to pretty girls like you. Ouch. <laughs> that was awful. Uh, really? I thought it was pretty smooth myself. Look at me. I'm swooning. Why are you being... Oh, nope, wrong one. Uh, I want that one. So, you got it. Spare so, time. Nothing much. Um... Travel? I bounce around. See everything I can. Mm-hmm. So, you got it. All right, that, that didn't so, much. Nothing. Nightlife? Come to places like this. Really? You don't seem the type. Maybe there's more to me than meets the eye. Somehow, I the, doubt that. The fedora... The fedora gives, gives it away, doesn't it? So, you got a quest. Spare so, time. Nothing much. Uh, shows. Go to concerts. Maybe taking a show. So you're a watcher, huh? Well, I like watching you. <laughs> Ouch. <laughs> uh, so, you got uh, her hometown. Uh, nowhere special. Where are you from? Uh, right here. here. Born and raised. Somehow, I could tell. Yeah. So, you got a quest? Oh, Where are you no. from? Uh, nowhere. Uh, down from south? Down south. Really? Wouldn't have guessed that. I thought southerners were gentlemen. Ooh! I'm many things, sweetheart, but a gentleman isn't one of them. <laughs> right. Yeah, well, she probably would so, like the bad boys right now. Yourself. You got a quest? Where are town. Uh, out, out west. west. Really? Whereabouts? Uh... I'm not they sure. They kind of look the same, you know? Sure. <laughs> so, you. you got a question? Over down. I travel. What you call a citizen of the world. Fine. But y'all mysterious. I don't care. <laughs> I'm having fun so, with these options. You got a um, so, so I should go back here. Uh, help lost spirits move on to the next world. She said spare time. <laughs> Dang it. Hi. Ouch. Really? Look at me. Alright, um, so, you got hometown, 
see. Up, up north. north. I see. Out, so, yeah, out west is the one that we want. Hometown. The, the Midwest. Really? Whereabouts? Uh, or we could do that. Um, I guess it's basically the same. Kansas. Kansas. Oh, never been there. So. You got where are you down? The Midwest. Really? Where? I think Wisconsin is the one we want. Uh, Wyoming. Wyoming. Oh, never been there. Let's actually, so, check the, the West it. thing. Where are you? Uh, uh, are those actually the same? Out West. Really? Where about? Yep. Illinois. No way. So am I. Don't. We're in Illinois. Um, Chicago? Chicago? Oh, from city to city, huh? Somehow I could tell. <laughs> so, you got. I like how she doesn't get suspicious of us uh, keep changing the story like this. Midwest. Uh, okay, so Illinois is what we want, so Wisconsin. Wisconsin. Oh, never. Yeah. So, you got. Probably gonna be the same thing. Oops. Dang it. So, you got. Where are you? Oh, really? Where? Wyoming. No, wait, I did that one. I wanted Michigan. So, you got. Where are you? Maybe I've done that one. Oh, well. Yeah, we'll choose the right Really? Where? Uh, Illinois. No. Some, Some little, place. little place. You've never heard of it. Fine. Be all mysterious. I don't care. I need to figure it out. No. Alright. Hmm. So. You got it. Anything else? No. Uh, okay. I've got a scram, but uh, don't you go anywhere. I make no promises. Yeah, I think that is a promise you could keep, though. So that's about it. Yep. Sign. I just can't come to grips with it. It says this room is off limits. But I think that only applies to living people. Pretty much. You call this music? <laughs> ah, forget it. She can't hear me over this racket. Alright, well, uh... Let's go ahead and leave, see if we can figure out where she came from. Got a sec? You rang. I always ring. All right. chat with Joey? Let's get out of here. Don't. Check notes. Memories race. isn't really my kind of place. Well, maybe it's time to broaden your horizons. As long as I... Uh, all right. Nope. I think we've uh, talked about all of those. Okay. That's Say goodbye. All for now. Yeah. Um, back on the phone. Web search. Uh, what is it? Jamie... I don't see any. Okay. Jamie spent a lot of time at Munray's, according to Elaine Appleton. Nope. Hmm. Uh, well, actually, no, there's something about uh, Sam Durkin. That's something that we haven't really followed up on. Durkin. Hi, it's me again. I like how she never has to give her name. I wanted to talk to you about Jamie Graham. Who? Jamie, a Columbia student. I was told you were looking into it. You get around, don't you? Yep. I think Jamie and Jeremy might be connected. Could we talk somewhere? Why should I do that? Look, you owe me, and I might be able to help you out again. You could, huh? Like you said, I get around. What the hell? I need a cup of coffee anyway. You know a place Sweet. in Alphabet City called Cup of Clay? I'll find it. Okay, new location, Cup of Clay Cafe. Well, that works. Cafe! Is
It's the barista. Yes, it is. Pastries! Pretty good, actually. Oh, pastries. Oh, I want some. Organically grown. Not bad. It has a panel for milk and everything. Caramel espresso shots. I am so coming here when this is over. <laughs> it's the detective I met up on the High Line. Hi. Hi! You're new here, aren't you? Yes, I am. Yeah, my first time. I knew it. I never forget a face. Well, are you the only one who, uh... It's so tempting, but I've already had more coffee today Works than I here should. today? Aww. Do you know the detective over there? Durkin? He's a regular. Okay. Thanks. I'll see you around. Have a good night. Hi. Ever not detective work? Durkin? Oh, it's you. Yes, so, it is. What can I do for you? Well, um... So why are you looking into Jamie's death? Her teacher said it was natural. Yeah. Well, she was right. It looked that way, sure enough. And looked that way, huh? The body was found in a dumpster off of Amsterdam. Ooh. Natural or not, how did the body get in yeah. there? That's uh, very uh, suspicious. A dumpster? So it was murder? I didn't say that. It was three blocks away from some nightclub. We learned she was a regular, so we went over. She bought it in the upstairs room. Some kind of VIP area. One minute, dancing the night away. The next, lights out. Nobody saw how she died, just that she was dead. Anyway, the bouncer saw it and freaked, so he snuck her out and dumped her. Like I said, cut and dry. Case closed. I, I think that guy could probably be arrested for that, you know. How are you sure she wasn't murdered? We have this thing called a coroner's report. Right. What did it say? I don't know the medical term, but some kind of brain vessel burst? It happens. And One you're thing's pretty sure. sure that could no be murdered any other way. Just rotten luck. Yeah. What else did the coroner's report say? Nothing too important. Why? I don't know. Could I see it? <laughs> you do owe me. Yeah, I, I don't do. know about that, but you certainly do get around. Yes, Look, I do. I can't give you the actual report, but I can give you the gist. You might be nuts, but for some reason, I think you're alright. Why, well, thank you. Don't thank me. You owe me now. You got a phone? Yeah. When we finish here, I'll send you a message. Oh, thank you. What about the status of Jeremy? So, any progress on Jeremy? Look, you helped us out on the ID, but don't push it. You know about as much as I do. Okay, well, let's check our notes. Um, Tiffany Walters. Does the name Tiffany Walters mean anything to you? Nah. Do the initials STP mean anything to you? Nah, sorry. Do Rachel? you know any Rachels? Nah, sorry. Thrown away like trash. That's horrible. You're surprised? You know what happened up on the High Line. Some well, people yeah, are animals. Shot. They choke someone's mother to death for no good reason. You know, actually referring to people as animals tends to uh, lead to uh, harsher sentences, so you should probably not do that, Durkin. You spoke to Professor Appleton. The Graham kids, Prof? Yeah. Why? No reason, really. King Graham? Oh my god, she's related to King Graham. This club where Jamie died. It was Munray's, wasn't it? You get around. Yeah, that was the place. You, you don't have anything else to say, though. Do you know anyone named Gavin? You're gonna have to be more specific than that. Uh, He's kind of a cult leader. I'm not sure what he does yet. Yet? Have you heard of him or not? Nah, sorry. Damn it. Uh, I don't have any other options. Um, oh, How come Munray's? Munray's is still open after what they did? How do you think any club stays open? Bribery? They offer favors and spread money around to the right people. So bribery. The whole thing never happened. It's all hushed up. Nothing in the papers, even. Oh, I think we might be able to fix that, hopefully. Hopefully. Well, bye. See ya. I do hope we can fix that. Hey, check it out. I got a message from Durkin. Uh-huh. Notes updated. Coroner's report. Something disappear from here? No, I guess not. Probably just because uh, Mudrays was there before. Alright, let's go home. Got a sec? Yeah. Got anything new to say, Joey? Alright. Yeah, apparently not. That's all for now. Yeah.
I get what to do? Oh, I guess it's under notes. Okay. Coroner's report. Subject, Jamie Grand. Blood work clean. No sign of harmful or illegal substances. Cause of death, traumatic hemorrhage due to spontaneous bleeding into the brain tissue. This coroner report doesn't tell us anything we didn't already know. Hmm. If there's a connection... Well, crap. Um, hmm. So we still have our laptop that we haven't been able to get into. Maybe Munrays is the uh, password. We can go try that. <laughs> oh, yay! I don't have to do that each time. Fantastic. Munrays? Middle East. Um, Mesopotamia. Damn it. Gavin? Oh, Benji. Hmm. Benji? Nope. Wait. Ben G. Oh. Had to be lowercase. Ha <laughs> ha! So that's why we had that note. All right. Don Graham. You doing okay? Just thought I'd check in. You doing all right out there? Things are the same back west. Drop your mother a line. Let her know how you're doing. Everyone here back in Illinois misses you. Aha, so we get that. Right. Sarah Elmalay. El Elmalay. That, I, I think that's, uh... I think that might be her voice actress or something like that. Jamie, did you hear that Allie and John got married? They eloped last week. Made her mom furious. They're living in Mattoon now. You'd think they would want to move further away from here, but whatevs. Come visit soon. Uh, Mattoon, maybe. That might be the place. Uh, Lisa Tenzin, Jamie, I think, I think I've taken you as far as I can, dear. This dark energy around you just won't lift, and it might be beyond my abilities. Come by my office as soon as you can. I'm going to send you to someone who can do the job better than I can. Seb Frederick, hey, Jamie, just wanted you to know that I had a great time last night. The past few weeks have been great, even. Want to get together again tomorrow? Seb. Gavin. Thank you for getting in touch. Lisa told me about your problem, and I do believe I can help. It will require some extreme changes in your life, but I think you can handle it. Let's meet tomorrow. And remember, things are never as bad as they seem. Don Graham. Is what I'm hearing true? Are you really failing three subjects? Jamie, you were doing so well. What's gotten into you? Call me anytime, Dad. Se Seb Frederick. You know what? Forget it. You want to get high and piss your life away in that Munray's dump? Then go right ahead. I don't care. I'm done. What the hell happened to you? New from Sarah. Jamie, is what they are saying true? Please answer and say it's not true. Oh, hey, Jeremy Sams. Hi, my name is Jeremy Sams, and I'm a reporter with the City Post. I was hoping to chat with you about your experiences with Gavin. We can do it over the phone, or I can buy you a coffee. Lady's choice. Ah. Oh. Seb Frederick, so you finally did it. You spiraled out of control and ended up where I thought you would. Jesus, why am I writing you? I know you're dead. This is stupid. I go to that nightclub, hoping to see you there. Why? I don't know. Why'd you do this, Jamie? Everything was so good. Well, maybe he's uh, still there at the uh, nightclub. Uh, I don't think there's anything else that we need to do. Can we get right into the laptop? Yes, we can. Probably not going to be any uh, new... Wait, wait a second. How does she have the email address benji at columbia.edu? I am pretty sure they would not let you choose your email address. Maybe it's because uh, <laughs> the game uh, uh, authors knew that Benji would not be a real uh, um, email address until there's a Ben NG uh, enrolled or something like that. <laughs> Actually, I'm not sure if Columbia.edu is the uh, actual address. All right, uh, can we talk Joey, to Joey? I'd like to talk to you. What's going on? It's been years since I was like. Can't believe. Uh, check notes. Nope. Already. Say That's goodbye. all for now. Yeah. All right. Well, let's uh, head back to Munrays in the next episode, and uh, we will uh, see if we can uh, take care of uh, Jamie. See you next time, everyone. <laughs>